question of origins. How did the universe and all things that we see here on this planet come into being? Why do we exist? Hi, I'm Roger Oakland. Most of us have pondered these questions. And when it comes to the subject of origins, there are basically two views. The evolution theory and the creation theory. During the 20th century, the world was led to believe that evolution brought about all things. Our universe, the earth, and all life came into existence as a result of an explosion of matter in billions of years of time. However, there are others who believe the observable evidence points towards a creator. So how can we know? What does the observable evidence indicate? Both evolution and creation scientists have observed and agree that there is great variety within each species. Darwin noticed this variety and adaptability among finches. He noticed that the finches' beaks varied in size and shape, and that the beaks' features affected the survivability of the finch. Today we notice a great variety of dogs. It is believed that all 450 breeds of dogs present today had a common ancestor. Most scientists believe that this ancestor was very similar to the present-day wolf. Scientists also witness natural selection, or survival of the fittest. Evolutionists and creationists agree that those animals that are the strongest, healthiest, or most adaptive to their environment are more likely to survive and go on to reproduce. The weaker animals, which are unable to adapt, are less likely to survive. We also observe gene mutations occurring. The DNA in all living organisms contains all the genetic information of life. Sometimes an error is introduced in this genetic code. This is called a mutation. Mutations often cause disease and can be induced by radiation, chemical agents, or replication errors. Mutations really do occur. They make all kinds of changes in genes. Uh, birth defects, disease, disease organisms, they're great at explaining the, the origin of disease, death, and disaster. Not at all at explaining the origin of something new, uh, some new trait that never exists. All the mutations we know about are only changes in genes that already exist. 